Hi everyone, it's Brenda. I'm here to do a video response for Karen Herrera here on YouTube. And she just hit 100 subscribers, so congratulations. And she's having a giveaway. Um, you make a pocket letter or a flip book, and I'm going to leave a link to her channel down below so you can check her out and subscribe and join along. You have until um, May 27th, I believe they're due. But yeah, check her uh, her video out to make sure that the um, details are correct. I don't want to give you any <laughs> um, false items there. But she did say any theme and any style. So this is my first ever pocket letter, so no laughing. <laughs> um, yeah, but I used some Studio G paper that I had laying around, and it's a uh, kind of blacks, whites, and grays, and I thought that would be, you know, the perfect base for the background, and then I can add pops of color just to make it stand out a little bit more, but I did love the floral background, so I wanted to use that, and I used some ephemera I had laying around, so I just decorated it up, and it says love, and I used some um, beaded wire here into a swirl, which I thought was really cute. Some flowers, I made a bow, and some bling there, and it's in the yellow, so it matches. And I really like the theme, I put some goodies here on the front, some ephemera pieces. And then the back, I don't want to show too much, but I'll flip over really quick so you can get a basic idea of some of the things that are in there. Just in case she doesn't want to see. And then I'm going to put my um, letter right here in the center. And yeah, I'm super happy. This is the first one I made, and I hope you like it, Karen. And I'll get this out to the mail to you ASAP. But yeah, everyone, check her out. And congrats again on 100 subbies. And thank you all for watching. Have a great day. Bye.